Making a top 10 of Led Zeppelin was really hurting because I needed to cut out many songs that I love. But let me know your favorite one in the comments. Here, since I'm showcasing drums only, I decided to focus on famous songs that are iconic for the drums with high skills requisite. And I have two big surprises for you at the end of the video. For each song I will play only the most important parts and I will tell you the minimum drum level to be able to play a decent gig. But of course it's far from sounding like John Bonham. So none of these 10 songs are in F tier. Hard to find any Led Zeppelin one being that easy anyway. In E tier we've got Kashmir. Minimum drum level 25. Bass drum needs some decent technique to be played tight. Next in D tier is Stairway to Heaven, minimum drum level 29. I will show you a couple of fills at the end that will require some 15 levels more to nail them. So if you're not experienced enough, you better avoid those fills for now. In my previous video about the 10 genres, I showed the reading skill. Here you don't need it, so I took it out for now. But there is another change. Improvisation skill instead of interplay. This is due to the patch 4.5.1. Since improvisation is more comprehensive and better represents this very important aspect of the game. Alright, let's proceed with C tier. Here we have the ocean, minimum level 34. This song is technically pretty easy actually, the problem here is structure, because we have different meters, 4-4 four, four plus 7-8 and 12-8 uh, with a faster beat. Also C tier is rock and roll with its iconic drums only start that makes it immediately recognizable. I love it. Minimum drum level 36 but for the drum solo at the end you will need some 12 more levels. I will show you the solo but in general I don't think it's good to copy other players in a live concert. A solo should always be a space to express yourself. Ok, B tier is pretty juicy. We have the tricky black dog, minimum drum level 38.
other bit here is dazed and confused. Minimum drum level 39 with a lot of fills and a fast part in the middle. The first eight tier is Immigrant Song with its relentless bass drum, minimum drum level 40. The last in eight tier is a big one, whole a lot of love, minimum drum level 42. Here many newbies will miss that the main groove is full of ghost notes. And of course, there is the drum solo in a psychedelic part in the middle. So you need improvisation skill. Good, we are in S tier and we find Full in the Rain from the last studio album of Led Zeppelin in 1979 with a very new groove for that time, the mythic Purdy Halftime Shuffle. This is the most difficult of their songs for coordination, minimum level 46. Ok, let me introduce to you the final boss. In S tier, the most difficult Led Zeppelin song for drums is... Good Times, Bad Times. Minimum drum level 50. Yeah, you need to be in semi-professional league to play it decently. The groove is hard to nail and the most demanding part is the bass drum 16 triplets, plus a variety of tough feels all over the song. First surprise is Moby Dick. Of course, we couldn't miss to mention the song used by Led Zeppelin to let John Bonham has his drum solo. Here, if we consider the skills to be able to play decently his solo, we need to go over level 60. I will improvise a short drum solo in his style.
The second surprise is the John Bonham character sheet. Okay, first, please, if you enjoyed the video, click like. It's important for me. Then you can follow my Instagram, link in description. You will find the character sheet there. See you very soon. Ciao.